Good morning, everyone. It's Mr. Stewart here for another assembly. I hope you're all safe and well. Um, don't forget to log on to the school website to get hold of your home learning packs. Um, and we're going to be starting our key stage two virtual lessons as well. Um, so hopefully, hopefully you're enjoying those. I want to say a big thank you to all the children who have shared their drawings of blue footed boobies on the Facebook page. They look absolutely brilliant. I'm so pleased. And I know Miss Clausen has got some more art lessons planned for you uh, over the next few weeks. So make sure you, you watch those and, uh, and, and take part. Um, I've got a story to share with you today and it's um, it's a really lovely story. And it's all about sometimes we fall out with the people we love the most, um, especially when we're all stuck together at home uh, and we can't go out as much as we normally would like to. Um, sometimes we just fall out and um, it's really important to remember that that's that happens. And, you know, people, you know, we do argue and we fall out with people that we love, but it's always important to to make that right and a really um, easy way to put that right is to say I love you and this story is called I forgot to say I love you it's called I forgot to say I love you and it's written by Miriam Moss and the pictures are by um, Anna Curry When Billy woke up, Rabbit was hiding down the side of his bed. Don't think I can't see you there, Rabbit, said Billy, tugging at Rabbit's paw. Time for breakfast, Mum called from downstairs. In a minute, shouted Billy, Rabbit is being naughty. Come on and wash your sticky paws, called Mum. In a minute, said Billy. Rabbit won't eat her egg. Hurry up, Rabbit. Billy and Rabbit went upstairs to get dressed. Mum popped her head round the door. Get dressed, Billy, she said. In a minute, said Billy. I think Rabbit's got a tummy ache. <sighs> Come on and brush your teeth, Billy, Mummy called. In a minute, said Billy. Rabbit's buttons are all wrong. Get ready first, Billy. Then you can play with Rabbit, said Mum. Dress at last, said Mum. But where did I put your boots? They're on my feet, laughed Billy. Oh, good, smiled Mum. Here's your coat. Come on, we really must go or we'll be late. But Billy dashed upstairs. Just a minute, he called. Rabbit hasn't said goodbye to the others. On the way to school, Billy balanced Rabbit and his lunchbox on his head. Be careful, said Mum. I am, said Billy, except Rabbit won't sit still. Suddenly, Billy's lunchbox hit the ground and burst open. Oh, Billy, said Mum crossly. Now we really will be late. Give Rabbit to me and let's get a move on. But they were very late and I had to run the rest of the rest of the way to school. Oh, there you are, said Mrs. Brown. We wondered where you were. Sorry, panted Mum. I must dash. I'm late for work already. Bye, Billy. And she hurried away. Billy hung his coat up. Is something the matter, Billy? asked Mrs. Brown. 
Mum didn't say I love you, said Billy. She always says I love you. Well, she was in a bit of a hurry, said Mrs Brown. Have you left Rabbit on your peg? She'll make you feel better. They looked in Billy's pockets and even in his lunchbox. But Rabbit was nowhere to be found. She must have left her at home, said Mrs Brown. But I didn't, said Billy, starting to cry. I dropped my lunchbox and we had to run and now Rabbit's lost and I want my mum. Suddenly, the door flew open. It was mum. Oh, Billy, I'm so sorry, she cried. I forgot to give Rabbit back to you. And I forgot something else too. I forgot to say, I love you. Billy climbed onto mum's lap and gently she dried his tears. I love you too, said Billy. And they gave each other a big, big hug. And that's the end of the story called I Forgot to Stay. I love you. Well, I hope you enjoyed that story. And like I said before, it's really easy to annoy each other um, and get upset. And Billy was being really silly. He was wasting mummy's time and made her late for work. Um, but in the end, they both said I love you to each other. And... Uh, and everything was was fine. Um, so remember, we need to make sure at home we're behaving properly, just like you would at school, you know, um, doing what's asked of you and really helping your parents out. OK, and I know lots of you are doing that, but I'd be really, really proud if you're all doing that. So anyway, have a lovely week. I'll see you very soon. I'm going to do another assembly later this week. Um, take care. Stay in touch. Um, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.